Let's play. All right, we're back in GTA 5. This is the Repo Mission Simeonomics, I believe it's called. Simeonomics? Simeonomics? Whatever. It's when you steal cars from a plane, and it's pretty easy. In fact, it's so easy to have it set on the hardest difficulty because, as far as I can tell, if you do it properly, there's no difficulty that will change between any difficulties. So, yeah. And I'm going to go to ammunition just to get some more heavy armor. Sorry, super heavy armor, even though I don't really need it for this one, because honestly, I'm not going to be getting shot at a lot, I hope, so let's just go, um, get some armor anyway. Do -do. Yeah. Um, nope. God damn it. The character is so slidey in this game sometimes, I swear. Alright, let's, uh, nope, no, no. There we go. Yep, alright, perfect. Also, I'm going to cut out the drive to the airport, and, uh, I'll see you guys there. Bye. Okay, here we are, Los Santos International Airport. I just kind of cut the drive here because, I don't know, nothing really happened. It was pretty mundane. It's basically point A to point B drive. Even the dubs are going to make it interesting. So, yeah, okay, let's be, be, let's be stealthy here, right? Do not want to get caught. I mean, it won't really do me any harm if I do. I prefer not to. Let's be stealthy. Oh, god damn it. Wh wh why? Who the fuck saw me? Why? Wh wh what just happened? Ugh, whatever. Let's just go over there, right? Damn it. I mean, to be fair, how could they miss a gigantic golden six wheeled truck? But still, I didn't see any guards from the one that gate who didn't actually see me. Anyway, let's just go grab it from the plane, shall we? So we have to do this twice. There are two cars I have to get. Um, and they're all. They're both worse than the cars I normally have anyway. Uh, for supercars, they're pretty bad. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm, the second one's probably gonna spawn after I grab this one anyway. Let's, um, let's get out of here. I might just call Lester at some point. I mean, I, I'll try not to, but I may need to, because I've got three stars right now, so, yeah. It's well, much know, easier to lose three stars in a mission, like the repo missions, than it is just in normal gameplay. For reasons, I'm guessing, just to make the missions that much easier, especially on harder difficulties. But, um, okay, wow. I don't know. Ooh, cinematic mode. Weirdo. That was a mistake. <laughs> anyway, yeah, this car is not good. It is slow. Excuse me, excuse me Mr. Police Officer. Thank you. There we go. Oh. No, I was, I'm, I'm gonna go backwards up this ramp because you can get onto the correct lane um, faster this way if you do it properly and don't crash. Uh, there we go. Doo -doo -doo. Oh, hello, officer. Yeah, again. I like how their only tactic is just to block you. And here, yeah, here we go. Transfer to this lane. Boom. It's much faster than going all the way around uh, unless you hit like a pileup of police officers, which I have done before. I actually played this level on a live stream yesterday. Um, so that's hey, why I know this up? one. I've only done it a few times, but it's apart from Blow Up, the one I did, I did a, a list plan yesterday, Blow Up, aka number four. Um, it's probably my favorite mission. Go away, Cortana. My controller, my, my headset is a little bit glitchy, so it keeps launching Cortana for whatever reason. I do apologize. Let me just check the time quickly. Yeah, there we go. Oh, God damn it. One level. Ugh. All right, let's just, okay, let's just get out of here. I'll take care of the LSPD. Ooh, I lost $600. Okay. Um, so now, oh, no, no, okay, there we go. Yay, thank you, Lester. <laughs> All right. Ooh, doo -doo. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's a pretty boring mission, honestly, although I don't mind it. It's boring, but it gets you a lot of, well, okay, a fair amount of cash for, considering how it only takes about, maybe 11 minutes, 12 minutes total. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah. I'm gonna call, I'm actually gonna cut out the second drive, because we have to drive back to the airport. It's just gonna say, I'm gonna, just gonna call my dubster back in. Not the Kuruma, because I don't really need the armor for this one. The dust is a lot of fun to drive, so I'm gonna call that one back in. Then when it gets here, I'm just gonna do the cut, and then like when it comes, when the when the video yeah, returns, up. it will be back at the airport again. Let me know. Yeah, pretty basic. I'll get there as soon as I, can. Uh, I, I miss the actual mechanic used to drive the car, like on the 360 and PS3 versions of the game. I don't, I don't know if it still does it, but like back like when the game first started, but online, the, the actual mechanic used to actually drive the car to you, and to throw them out, and sometimes you can actually hijack it back from you. Anyway, yeah. Uh, see you at the airport. Okay, so we are back at the airport almost. Um, should be pretty similar. Um, in fact, it should be the exact same as last time. Grab the car from the plane and drive back to the thing. Hopefully it won't get well, caught this time. It wasn't a big deal. I just prefer not to spend any money when in missions, apart from like, stuff from, like um, body armor. You know, because the more profit you get, the better. Uh, anyway, yeah, just be cost effective. Ooh, no, what, the good luck so far. So no, one, no one's seen us so far. That's good. Um... Do just a massive six wheel golden truck coming through. All right, let's go. Uh, uh, is that the plane? Nope, that's not it. Because I think the plane has two different spawning spots. I think it used to be All right, here we go. 
Doodly do. No, no cops here either. That's that's good. Probably pattern this one where they are. Um, there's no car here. This is supposed to be the narrow custom here, right? Oh, the mini the mini map saying it's actually not in the plane. Um, it's weird. Never read that before. Hmm. Okay, first time for everything, I guess. Now, where is it? Is it, is it in the hangar? No, it's, it's not that far, is it? Um, no, it's just right here, out here on the tarmac. It's right here on the freaking runway. Why is it over here? Wait, why? I've, I've, ne I've done this mission several times. I've never seen this before. This has never happened to me before. It's kind of weird. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, okay, it's just odd, whatever. Anyway, let's, let's get going. Still, no guards, no cops. Awesome. Cinematic camera. For some reason, this mission makes the cinematic camera do weird things. I don't know. Uh, I am, I am, I am lost. The cinematic camera is fun, looks pretty cool, but it's not exactly easy to uh, navigate with. Like, uh, goddamn. Okay, there is a guard. You saw me. Fuck. Oh well. Not, not again. Not a huge deal. Um. Anyway, yeah. It was, if you guys want a little bit of challenge, challenge your friends to a race only using the cinematic camera. Put in lots of twisty turns and. Uh, You'll have a good time. Now, where is... Oh, there, there, there's a door. All right. Hopefully there won't be any cops this time up here. I mean, it wasn't that bad last time, but oh, yep. Their only tactic is kind of to like block you, so I don't think you know which way they're going to slide. You can get around them pretty easily. And, uh, oh, no, here, there's, there's some more cops. That, that, actually, that wasn't too bad. All right, we actually appear to be in the clear this time. Wow. Maybe, maybe we'll actually use, need to use Lester at all. Actually, I don't think I can. It's been less than five minutes, actually, since I last, since I last used Lester. I think it's been about three and a half minutes or so. Uh, maybe, maybe, maybe it's been five minutes. I don't really know. Anyway, um, all right, losing him. Oh, crap. Uh, they are not as persistent as they are in this normal online multiplayer, just like open world stuff, but they will follow you. And they will definitely they'll also spawn in front of you more often in these missions than they will in just open online multiplayer. Uh, let's hide back here very quickly. Hide on the back street text the Maze Bank Arena. That's, that is that is what that is, right? Yeah, that yeah, is all right. Okay, now just drive back to the yeah, yeah there is the arena. Yeah, just drive back to the um, shop, and that should be the end of the video. As I said before, it's a very good mission for getting easy cash pretty damn quickly, especially when it's on double double XP double RP like it is right now. Um, but it's not the most interesting of missions. It's a mission I can just like I can listen to music and just zone out and do this mission with basically no problem at all. Like. Also, it's one of those cost-effective missions, because I, I, I didn't really have to buy body armor for this one. And also, you don't even need to fire a single shot to go, even though the hardest difficult. You do not want to crash here. This is not somewhere you want to trigger... Because like, if you crash mostly, basically one person here, you trigger like a, a mini gang attack. All right. Um, doo -doo -doo. All right. I'm turn here. Yep. This custom Nero is actually not very good. My Nero, which is not even the Benny's custom one, is way better. I think I got the I think I got the new when it first came out. It's a damn good car, still. I mean, my program, I think my program, I think the the, the knockoff McLaren F1 is faster, but still. All right, let's go. All right, that should be it. Did I just did I just break the window? <laughs> Why? Okay. Yeah, well, thirty six thousand nine hundred sixty. It's good. Fifteen JP, and then six thousand three hundred fifty six. All right, that should do it. Thanks for watching.